Somebody got knocked out of your brackets? Don't worry. There'll be another knockout coming very soon. Trying to get close. Use that jab. Find out what Danny Jacobs has to offer. Out since he first appeared on American television. A big string of them. Arch and the right hand. In the early going. Jacob now has, Jacobs with a flurry. Jacobs has real to when you attack Triple G like he did when you attack Peter Quillen. Right hand over the top misses. Jab landed a couple times. Good jab by Jacobs. Excellent jab. The opponent will be forcing a change in direction of the opponent. Inviting Golovkin to throw a straight right hand, which is the classic tactic. To, get to a skillful boxer at a certain level because he got has a middleweight. Well, can he hit him like that? Because we haven't seen anybody land. Uh, more than we've seen Triple G neutralized. Right hand over the top by Golovkin. In other words, eventually he makes the other guy really fight. What happens when that happens? Wasn't Body clean. shot by Daniel Jacobs. Wasn't clean, but it was close to and he climbed off the deck in the first round. Chuckle Latito appeared to win on our cards, but it was a tough fight. His number two, number two has got his hands full tonight with a fighter who's been able to neutralize him. That was just my opinion. He was a huge puncher, but he was winning all the rounds behind his jab as he was cautious. Not sure that's the case here. He just got caught with a good hook. Okay. Two rounds to one, Danny Jacobs. Hard right hand by Golovkin. Down goes Jacobs. Yep. First. So Golovkin has knocked Jacobs down. Let's see if he'll cut loose. Starting to land most of his shots now. These are hard jabs right on the chin. Beautiful jabs. Uppercut purposely and fiercely. Critical for... Good left hook by Daniel Jacobs momentarily. Trying to leave that impression in Golovkin's round or mind before the round is over. For that. Left hook lands for Golovkin, right hand as well. Jacobs Good right hand back. from Daniel Jacobs. Got untracked and, and started to really do damage. Can Jacobs actually fight with him? Golovkin yeah. landing the right hand again. Yeah, punches. It is impossible to stink Triple G out. Totally agree. He's trying to fight him. Yes. Good body shot Great by body Golovkin. shot by Golovkin. And was it saying to Daniel Jacobs that was totally unnecessary? Exactly. I thought that was about turning southpaw. Out. Good body. Strengths. Jacobs fighting out of that. 350 amateur fights. He knows what to do against anything. Good left hook by Jacobs. Reaching for Golovkin. Another. Jacobs erupting sporadically. Certainly hasn't given up Andre Rozier and listen to him as he barks out instructions to his fighter during the round. Let's see. He's walking. There you go. Don't pull up. Good shot. Hard right hand by Jacobs. Golovkin doesn't. His fight by a little bit against Pirov, the one loss. But he got caught with the right hand and not. And Golovkin treating him with considerable caution, except at those combinations like that. Golovkin had focused on the jab this round, so Jacobs has an edge and power shots here in round. It was something like shoe shining, but with more on it. This is a good scoring round. Sort of put his weaponry into the deep freeze just a little bit in round number six. And Daniel Jacobs. I got it three rounds apiece, but in points, 57. 56 honest enough to not give him the bums rush and then Jacobs quickness and comedy you have to you have no sense of urgency because all you gotta do is catch him again and that man. why does he keep going out of the left hand position stance I don't know because he keeps getting caught with Pete Lovkin moves in on the southpaw standing Jacobs and looks for another right Lovkin a right hook out of the southpaw position and now Golovkin lands another right hand driving Jacobs into the corner and Jacobs fights We've never seen Gennady Golovkin win a decision, though it happened. Good that has defense. not happened. That's exactly right. That was good defense by Danny Jacobs. We've already seen. Yeah, or he could oh, be. Just don't hold him behind the head. They both fire in the closing seconds, and they fight after. The crowd is chanting, Daniel, Daniel. The good one, too. Get Golovkin with a series of right hands. Golovkin touching Jacobs up along the ropes. 
Jacob fights his way off. Golovkin begins to focus on the right hand again. Not seeing the same thing the whole time. Well, you got a clue when you heard Andre Rozier say, we fight. Right, it seems to be when Triple G does his best work. Yeah, exactly. Golovkin attacking a little more in this round. Good right hand by Jacobs. Tonight, this is a competitive fight. Oh, this right, right hand by Golovkin, Jacobs. Your old heist for Golovkin, partially blocked. Lands a one-two. One more victory for Granati Golovkin as we go to round nine. It was strategic for Daniel Jacobs. Good shot by both fighters. So he made the 160-pound limit fair and square, and then decides that Triple G will catch him with something big that will signal the beginning Hard of the right end. rounds. That's not what I'm saying. What I'm saying is he's still used to seek and destroy. He's not used to have than anybody has during the 23 knockout streak. Oh, good uppercut by uppercut by Golovkin. Right good hook by Jacobs. Shots. Oh, good right uppercut. Uppercut by Golovkin. Right hand by Golovkin. He's going to work, showing a sense of urgency. Yeah. And momentarily got him in trouble. Golovkin. G hurt Jacobs upstairs in that last round. He went to the body, and that opened up further punishment. 84, Gennady Golovkin. Big shot. Jim, I think that Gennady's winning, you know, five rounds to four, Gennady Golovkin. Jacobs landed some. More active right now. There he is, moving his hands very good. He just got to be careful. Surprising out of his southpaw stance. Never saw that really. Oh, good right hand. Never saw that out of him a lot. Jacobs is firing in this particular round. Good block. Right hand by Gennady. G is head hunting. Jacobs is able to avoid some of those big shots. I think that as the clearly shorter man, Golovkin might want to get inside and throw more body shots. That's making him hesitant to go downstairs. But, but that's... Oh, throughout most of the... Oh, good career. hook by Dan. Another good hook by Dan. Give and take by both fighters. They gotta stay locked up because Triple G will do stuff like that on the inside. But Triple G is still thinking offense, so he has to be very careful. This would be an incredible upset if Jacobs could pull it off. And he's in the 11. Body shot by Golovkin. Another body shot by Golovkin. A good Uppercut by Golovkin. A good hook by Danny. Triple G has fought and beaten some solid fighters. And Fight would certainly appear to be up for grabs. And in a packed Madison Square Garden. Shot. And the local kid climbs off the deck and does this. Refereeing the fight. Yes, he has. We barely said a word about it. Listen, Tokyo. Golovkin, because of his dominance, has been compelled. Oh, nice good hook. And Adi Golovkin has had 23 knockouts in a row. You got to be really careful here because Golovkin is really throwing some big shots. And so is Daniel. Good, good, jab, uppercut. good uppercut by Golovkin. Taken Triple G's vaunted power is very impressive tonight. Those are the punches I'm talking about, Max. When he oh, gets him in, he's not set. Not another another little left hook inside by Golovkin. Oh, catching Triple G on the angle. Oh, good right hand Great by right Jacobs. Wow. Right hand by Jacobs. Wow. Oh, good shot by Golovkin. Oh, big. Coming. One of these big punches produces a knockdown. It could seal the fight one way or another. Good right hand by Triple G. Around. I agree. Get knocked down. Good left hook by Jacobs. Needs another one like that. Right hand by Golovkin. Gennady Gennadyovich Golovkin.